I don't know if he got thrown from the vehicle or what the case is. Oh, there he is. Oh man, that's not good. One leg and 18 dispatch. Can you roll me a 1052 for? I guess I should have just taken him out. I'll do it. Oh, or you better drop that gun. Holy smokes, comes out with an automatic. So one leg and 18 dispatch. Can you show me 1041 today available for calls? Hello gaming fans as well as my amazing YouTube subscribers and welcome back to LSPDFR. My name is Daniel Parks and if you guys are new here make sure to go ahead and smash that subscribe button and if you guys like the video make sure to go ahead and leave a huge thumbs up. In this episode we're going to be trying out a brand new plugin that is going to be the predecessor to Bait Car which I'm really excited about. So I've got a car over here. That little baller right there that we're going to be heading over to the Grove Street type of area. And we're going to drop it off there. And uh, we'll go ahead and see if we can get anybody to take it uh, using this new new plug-in. So we're going to go ahead and jump into first person. And go ahead and start heading that way. Yeah, tell me about it. Do hope you guys are having a great week so far. Oh, that was a yellow. I am using the FOV mod, if you can't tell, allowing me to be able to see a little bit more out of the car and stuff. It's kind of a little more normal, I guess. Uh, this was a suggestion uh, to use this, and you know, I really like it so far. I'm really glad I'm d using it, especially for LSPDFR. It makes things a lot easier to be able to see uh, left and right, being able to see more of uh, you know what I need to see. So. You know, it's really helping out so far. All right, so I parked the vehicle straight across the street over there on the other side of Grove Street. I am just up the road just a little bit further, so I'm going to go ahead and watch. It is equipped with GPS, so as soon as it starts moving, even if it gets out of line of sight, I'll still be able to track it down. So we're going to go ahead and wait here until, you know, somebody hopefully steals that, that baller out over there. All right, so this person right here on my left just kind of ran past me. And it kind of looks like they are heading that direction. I don't know where they are coming from. Just down that alleyway, I guess. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of watch them, see what they do. It actually looks like they are heading that way to go ahead and jump in. So I'm going to kind of wait here until I figure out if they're going to go straight, left, or right. Oh, wow, why would they go forward in that parking lot? Good grief, man. Has never driven before or something. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I got up, but still. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and let him just get a little bit further. I'm going to go ahead and light him up down here. He's pushing that vehicle. I'm actually going to go ahead and light him up. And if he doesn't stop, I'm going to go ahead and kill the vehicle. Uh, let's see. There it goes. He's trying to start it up again. Get out of the vehicle, get out of the vehicle, get out of the vehicle now. The get down, get down, get down the ground. Hey, thanks, man. That guy wasn't going nowhere. All right, put your hands on your back. Thank you. Go ahead and grab you and pull you over here. What's your name? Luigi? All right, Luigi. Let's go ahead and walk over here. Do you have anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, hurt me, or anything like that? You sure? All right, let's go ahead and search you. All right, so nothing. He doesn't really have anything on him. Go ahead and sit him down because I do not have anywhere I can put him in my truck. So one leg and 18 dispatch. Can you roll me an additional 32 for transport, please? Uh, we'll go ahead and get that in there. I love that Silverado, man. I think it's so nice. Especially yeah, as an undercover vehicle. I don't think. Oh, I can't get into it. All right. Uh, well, I guess I need to start it again. All right. Let's go ahead and move it. Go ahead and move it just right over here. Into this parking lot right here. All right, so I'm actually just parked right across the street. Uh, just kind of uh, 
sitting here for about two hours now. I've been sitting here waiting for someone to come steal this uh, steal this vehicle. It might not be a very good spot. You know, who knows? You know, again, it's just equipped with GPS, so if anything happens on it, you know, or to it, I can just hunt it down and, you know, pull them over and stuff, so, you know, it's no big deal, but so far, nothing, uh, nothing has, has bit yet. You know, it's one of those things like fishing, you know, you can put it in a good spot, but you never know if somebody's actually going to take it or not, and sometimes they'll watch it for a couple of hours before they end up doing so anyway. All right, so it looks like somebody's actually jumping into it now. That's pretty nice. Didn't take much longer. Now they're backing out, heading into traffic. I'm going to go ahead and turn my lights back on. So we're going to do a U-turn here. I did not think that part all the way through. Let's go ahead. Yeah. All right, so this guy is smashing it through here. I finally caught up. Oh, no. Go ahead and pull him over. Oh gosh! Now's a good time to kill it. Now's a good time to kill it. Uh, get out of the vehicle now! Get out of the vehicle now! Get out of the vehicle now! Get down! Get down! Get down! Get down! All right. Put your hands behind your back. No, no. Get back down. Get back down. Don't you dare. I don't even think about it. All right, there we go. It's a little awkward spot right there, though. <laughs> All right, what's your name? Sydney Soros? All right, Sydney. I'm pretty sure you understand what just happened, right? No, you don't? All right, well, that was a bait car, and you just stole it. So let's go ahead. Do you have anything on you that's gonna poke uh, that's gonna poke me, stick me, hurt me, or anything like that? Okay. A large sum of money, more uh, morphine, and a baseball cap. All right. Go ahead and sit you down there. One leg, eighteen dispatch. Can you roll me a thirty-two for transport, please? And go ahead and get them on their way. I'll go ahead and write up the paperwork for this one. Backup required for a suspect placed under arrest in Rancho. As soon as the uh, backup gets here, I'll go ahead we'll and Roger. write up that paperwork. But hopefully this uh, transport will be able to get this girl here soon. I might have to move my vehicle out of the way. Let's go ahead and get my vehicle out of the way. I think if I can move mine, they can squeeze in here on this other side. They just won't be able to get over there. I'm gonna park it right here, be a good spot. There they go. I guess that pole really deserved that, huh? Man, they jacked this car up, man. It's poor baller. Oh. I like that, man. I really do. All right, so I think I'm going to head to a different area. I'm going to get out of the Grove Street area. I think we've kind of made our presence known out here, and people are going to really stop taking these. So I'm going to let uh, one of the other units pick that up, and I'm going to go ahead and head maybe to the Vinewood area, uh, into the uh, the richer side of uh, Los Santos, and go ahead and see if we can get you know a different kind of criminal out there. Or at least, you know, one that goes after, you know, higher quality cars. All right, so, so far about three hours, and we have not had anybody uh, coming to get it as of... Oh, spoke too soon. All right, so they did just take the vehicle. So we're going to start... Oh, let me go ahead and go into first person before I crash here. But it's going to be over here to my right. Go ahead and just double check. Nobody coming that way. Oh, they're coming this way. Dad, come it. Go ahead and light them up. Come on, man. Move out of the way. Oh, really, dude? All right, let's go ahead. I got to make sure that they're in a safe spot. I can't just shut it down. Let's make sure they are in a safe spot. Then I'm going to. Wow, they're just doing a circle on the block. I think they're in a pretty good, pretty good spot. Yep, go ahead and shut it down, dadgummit. 
There's a good spot as any. Come on, get out of that menu. Get out of the car. Get out of the car now. Get down the ground. Get down the ground, lady. Get down the ground. Come on. There you go. Especially with these uh, you know, types of arrests, you never really know. If they're stealing a vehicle, you never know if they're actually going to be doing what they're supposed to be doing and what they're going to be carrying and stuff like that. All right, man, what's your name? Casey Reynolds? Hey, man. All right, Casey. Hey, girl. <laughs> hey, girl. Are you ready to go to jail? Is that what you're saying hello for? All right, man, do you have anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, hurt me, or anything like that? Oh, geez. Awkward. I fixed that before I do that. Nope, he's gonna do it again. Just, yep. <laughs> All right, so nothing of it. Just go ahead and sit down for me. I one like an 18 yeah, dispatch. Can you roll me a 32 for a, a suspect under arrest? So we'll go ahead and get that uh, transport out here. Let's see, are they gonna call it in or no? There we go. A little bit slow today. All right, so let's go ahead and double check the car and make sure they didn't take anything that they or bring anything with them and go ahead and put it in the seats or anything like that. Let's go ahead and just double check. All right, so now just a pack of pencils and a shopping bag. All right, so they're going to take her down. I'm going to go ahead and move the vehicle. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy moved. I'm going to go ahead and move it uh, over here behind uh, Tiki Lala. All right, so we've got about two and a half hours uh, waiting here. I just wait for someone to to take it. Yeah, you know, it's one of those things where it's, you know it's always going to take a little bit longer, especially after you've already done it once in this kind of area. And after this, one, we're going to go ahead and move into uh, a different different part. Uh, but I really like this uh, plugin so far. I think it's been really uh, really nice. I know they've got a lot of other things that they are adding in. Uh, for future things like uh, having a team with you and being able to have different uh, things going on uh, with that as well as adding some new vehicles and some other stuff that they're going to be adding in so I think that's going to be really neat as well and you know it's just yeah right now it, it does have a couple little bugs here and there but I mean ultimately it's really nice you can change everything in the any file and you know I just I really enjoy this this kind of stuff you know this is a little bit different you know it's different than taking calls and speeding around from place to place a little bit different but you know it's also a lot better uh, to, to do this every once in a while and yeah, it's kind of like a lot of the other plugins that we have I, I think it's you know really handy so so wait for someone to take it I hope they haven't seen me over here or anything but anyway so I do hope you know you guys are uh, you know enjoying this as well it's a little different, you know, it's different than some of the other patrols we get into. I have decided here recently I'm going to be doing, uh, whenever I do like a wheel cam like this, I'm actually going to be doing one as an overlay of the other, and then I'm going to be uploading both videos so you guys can see it with the webcam and you can see it without the webcam depending on what you guys want to see. Uh, and I think it's going to be a little better that way. I know some people can't stand wheel cams and some people love them. And I want to make sure everybody gets, you know, an idea, of, you know, get gets whatever they want, you know. Uh, today is also very exciting. I did just reach 300 subscribers, uh, is and that's awesome. Uh, you know, that's one of those things moving on up, you know, slowly but surely. Uh, you know, we had a, a couple of weeks there where it was growing, you know, five and ten a day, which was really nice uh, to have, you know. But you know, I don't. You know, I don't care how they come, you know, I just want to keep making content that people enjoy and that's the most important part for me. I also uh, was, uh, you know, I had a couple of people ask me, uh, you know, to do some tutorials about setting up, you know, getting all of this set up and stuff like that. And I think I'm going to do that here pretty soon. I want to make sure that everybody can, uh, if you guys want to, get everything set up here. Looks like we have a female approaching the car now. Looks like a female anyway. Getting in the driver's seat and driving off. And they would take a right out of here. I'm going to go ahead and go up over the curb. I don't want to be losing them there. Come on, car. Move it. All right. Because they do not. I mean, hopefully she's going to drive it a lot nicer than some of these other people have. My goodness. Driving it all over the place. Luckily, up here is not that big of a deal as far as getting it. You know, getting them to be 
in a bad spot or anything like that, so I'm not too worried about it. But they are right in front of this uh, SUV, three cars up. Hopefully they take a left here, yeah. Ah, man, what are the chances both of those cars would turn the same route I was? Let's go ahead and kill it. Uh-oh, I guess it got relaunched somehow. That's one of those bugs that I was talking about, how you know sometimes it'll work, sometimes it'll pop itself back on. All right, let's go ahead and... Yeah, that's right. All right, get out of the vehicle. Get out of the vehicle now. Hands up in the air, now. Yeah, definitely a female. No, get that. What are you doing? What the crap? Get out of the vehicle. Lady, come on. Get out. There you go. Look at that. A little dangerous. I don't know what I was doing there. Come on, get out of the vehicle. Me get out of the vehicle. Jeez, man. Lady, get down the ground. Whoa, Don't she's been drinking. Clearly been drinking. Come on, lady. Start to listen. I'm about to pull the taser out. All right, go ahead and put your hands behind your back. There you go. Nice. All right, what's your name? Rachel? Rachel? Robinson? All right. All right, Rachel, do you have anything on you that's going to poke me, stick me, hurt me? Jeez. <laughs> Just, there's no pleasant way of doing that. All right, go ahead and sit down for me. One leg and 18 dispatch. Can you roll me a 32 for a suspect? All right, so they'll go ahead and get that on their way. And look at that car, man. That, that Silverado, I absolutely love it. It's really nice. And I have found that it's actually easier uh, to drive with a wheel and the pedals with a, oh wow, they're gonna show up in the same vehicle, hey that's hilarious. Uh, they, you know, it's actually easier to drive with the wheel and pedals with the FOB mod. Uh, it really is. It was, you know, I had to change it. It's not, I think it's, it's 80. 80 is my uh, field of view. All right, lady, go ahead, come on over here. I'll go ahead and stand her up. Oh, geez. Let's go ahead and do, I want to do a breathalyzer test on her really quick. Let's go ahead and have her do this. Go ahead and breathe into this tube for me. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. No? She's definitely under the, well, really, lady? No, lady, get down on the ground. Uh, what, how did she? Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. What's your problem? All right. Finally got her. I don't know what's going on with that. There you go. I don't know how she broke out of her handcuffs. Whoa. She just poured it over there. I wonder if I can use, why is the glass back here? I have the special glass, but. All right, so he picked her up. I'll go ahead and let the, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and move the, oh, come on, dude, really? Give me some some room. All right. Go ahead and move the car out of the way as well. He's got to run over there. And I think we have one more vehicle we're going to try out and see if we can get someone to, to take it. It's going to be the, the nicest vehicle we have. Just damage that, this car. But it's going to be an adder. So we'll go ahead and let them take this one. And we'll go ahead and head into uh, some of the, the richer parts over by the golf course and something like that. So we'll go ahead and get this one taken care of, and we'll uh, see you guys over there. All right, so we are parked over here in the actual golf course. I was like, hey, it's not, not bit too bad of an idea. They know there are going to be you know rich cars here, so you might as well go ahead and uh, you know steal one from here. So let's go ahead and see what we can get into. Again, it's kind of late in the afternoon. This is going to be the last one for today. Let's go ahead and see if anybody wants to take this adder off our hands. Now, this is a very fast car, but I am very glad that we can shut it down pretty easily. So let's go ahead and wait around, see what we can get into. All right, so it looks like we actually have somebody heading that way now. We're actually going to go ahead and not even let them out of the parking lot because that's going to be a super fast car to be taken off in. So 
let's go ahead and kill it once they get down here. There we go. Shut down. Oh, man, that was a tight squeeze. All right, let's go ahead and get in behind them. Yeah. All right, get out of the vehicle now. Get out of the vehicle now. Get down, man. Get down. Get down. All right. You gotta put your hands on your back. Put your hands behind your back. Got it. Uh, what's your what's your name? Andy. Andy Rickson. Okay. All right, man. Do you have anything on you? Just gonna poke me, stick me, hurt me, or anything like that? Ah, oh, weed on you. Okay, that's nice. It's good to know. Let's go ahead and see if, uh, how do I, oh, it opens up in the back. That's nice. I don't see the handle or anything. Oh, that's a tight squeeze. <laughs> I closed the door, though. All right, let's go ahead and just double check the vehicle, make sure you didn't get anything in there. Oh, uh, yeah, look at that. That is a very nice undercover vehicle. A large sum of drugs and an iPhone 7, which does, you know, that makes sense, considering the dude had weed on him. Let's go ahead and let them take that. I'm going to go ahead and move this car around to the other side. Go ahead and let it start back up. There we go. Oh, this car is so fast. <laughs> Jeez. This car is so fast, man. All right, so I'm going to head back over here. And uh, take this guy down to the uh, police station, which is going to be just right around the corner, just down the street a little bit. So we'll go ahead and take that, and then we'll finish everything up here. All right. Nice. Yeah, I really like this uh, Field of View mod. It is uh, really nice to, to have. Uh, I mean, really, really nice to have. I like the fact that I can, you know, I don't have to look as far to see the same kind of stuff. And I like being able to see, you know, what it'd be in real life. You know, you can see a lot of your vehicle if you're sitting in your seat. You can see a lot of your vehicle, uh, a lot more than, you know, the 63 or 65 uh, field of view that it actually gives you uh, starting the game. So uh, my only complaint about this particular model, I absolutely love this thing. Uh, the only thing that I do not like about it is the dials don't match up the way they're supposed to. Like you can tell the speedometer, uh, the actual needle is a lot higher up than uh, it's supposed to be. And so it ends up looking a little funny. But you know, it's a small thing. It's something I can deal with. Uh, as far as the lights and stuff goes, everything looks great on the inside and the outside. So, you know, I don't have any complaints with that either. Uh, my only other thing is the lights that show through, like right there in the tailgate, you can see them shining through. But again, small things that I can deal with. Yeah, it is the ELS, which is really nice. Really nice. All right, I am about to pull up to the police department now. Uh, I do hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, make sure to go ahead and leave a huge, huge thumbs up. And if you guys, you know, like what I create, I like the things that I do, make sure to go ahead and subscribe as well as give me feedback. You know, that's the most important thing is uh, getting the feedback uh, from you guys. So, you know, make sure to do that as well. I uh, greatly appreciate it. And even just chit chatting with you guys is always awesome for me. Uh, but I do hope you guys continue to have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the day. And I will see you guys in the next episode.